After you've built your survey, you'll need to create a survey distribution in order to send your survey to respondents. A distribution is a single occurrence of your survey. You can run the same survey again in the future by creating a new distribution. To create a distribution, select Surveys from your school dashboard. Locate the survey you want to distribute and select Distribute from the Actions menu. Select the Create New Survey Distribution button. Something to consider when creating distributions is that reports of your survey results can include a maximum of three distributions. If you want all response data included in the one report, be sure to include all your recipients in no more than three distributions. Go to the Distribute Survey page to nominate a distribution name, select a distribution type and reporting year, and set survey start and end dates. The distribution name field is pre-populated but can be changed. There are three distribution types, anonymous, anonymous with survey code, and anonymous with personal code. Select the help icon for an explanation of each type. The school year that your survey is allocated to will be used in the running of historical reports comparing yearly data. By default, the survey availability is immediate and has no end date. You can change this as required. Select Create Survey Distribution and review the details of your distribution. The next step is to select a distribution mode. School Survey provides three modes for distributing a survey. A bulk email distribution with a link to the survey, a hard copy document, a manual distribution, which allows you to circulate your survey link in a newsletter or on a website. The most common and simplest mode is distribution via email. You can enter recipient details individually or upload a spreadsheet file containing multiple recipients using one of the available templates. You are able to customise your message and view the email before your survey invitations are sent. If you want to send reminder emails to your respondents at a later date, return to the Distribute Survey screen and select the Send Reminder Emails button. To distribute printed copies of the survey, select Generate PDF from the Distribute Survey screen. You need to enter instructions for returning the survey. If you are using personal access codes, you need to enter the number of copies you require. To distribute a survey manually, copy and paste the survey link into a newsletter, website, form or email. If you are using unique personal access codes, you need to distribute these to the recipients individually. After you receive your responses, you can compile them in reports. In the next video, we'll look at compiling reports.